Hi guys, welcome to Rapturous House. My name is Tanya. I hope you all are doing absolutely, absolutely wonderful. Today's reading is going to be for my Virgos. Let's see how your person currently feels about you guys, okay? I do want to thank you all. I want to thank you all for all your likes, all your comments, all your shares. They're all greatly, greatly appreciated. If you haven't yet subscribed to the channel, please do so. That way you'll get notified anytime I upload any new video footages, but also that way I'm able to tug on your energy, okay guys? Please remember only take what's yours, leave everything else behind. If you would like a personal reading, my website's information is down in the description below. That is the only way that you're able to obtain a personal reading, okay? All right, I do call on the Holy Spirit. I call on the white light that guides us. I call on the goddesses that gives us our strength and the angels that protect us. Show me spirit. Show me what it is I need to see for my Virgos. Guys, I would like to send a special shout out to all my members, guys. Thank you. Thank you for supporting the channel. For all my subscribers, guys, welcome. Welcome. Thank you for joining me. All right, show me spirit. How does my Virgos person feel about my Virgo? How does my Virgo's person feel about my Virgo? I wonder if you're happy without me. So somebody's wondering if you're happy with that without them. Somebody's extremely attracted to you guys and just being near you is intoxicating. Yeah. For some for somebody here, there's someone here that you're not with. And they are, they're wondering, like they're, they're remembering everything about the, the detail of the day that you and this person split ways, parted ways. However you and this person parted ways, this person is still reminiscent of this. This person is wondering if you're happy without them. For a lot of you guys, there's somebody here. This person is extremely attracted to you. Yeah. I hid who I really, who I really am from you. This person wasn't real. This person wasn't real. This person made you feel some type of weight, but they wasn't real about it. Will we be together again? So the person, your person right now, present moment, yeah, I can't stop thinking about you. So your person, the person that you're thinking about right now, present moment, the person that you're dealing with, this person cannot stop thinking about you, whether you're with this person or not. Whether you're with this person or not. There's an energy here of someone here that can't stop thinking about you. Um, there's an energy here for some of you guys. Somebody's thinking that you're going to be together again. There is someone here that uh, some of you guys are extremely attracted to this person. This person is extremely attracted to you. There's 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 about two or three different energies here. There's about two or three different energies here. Whereas there's someone here that you someone some of you guys you're not with this person. And this person is wondering if you're happy without them. They think about you every single day. They can't stop thinking about you. They want to. For a lot of you guys, there's two different energies here. And there's an, there's an overall energy of individuals that can't stop thinking about you. Whether you're with them or not with them. There's someone here that's extremely, extremely attracted to you. It says just being near you is intoxicating. Somebody knows that you, somebody feels, not about knows, this person feels that you're going to be together again. But but I feel like you, you guys have been dealing with somebody here that wasn't, they weren't showing you their true self, their true face. You no. Know? How does my Virgo's person feel about my Virgo spirit? Ooh, the Ace of Wands. This person thinks about you sexually a lot page of swords and this person stalks you like crazy this person thinks about you about the passion and the intimacy you, with you a lot there's a there's somebody here that you're not having sex with and this person wants to have sex with you this person thinks about it a lot this person is stalking you this person is watching you on social media this person finds you extremely extremely attractive this is this is not somebody that you're playing with right now present moment no show me death scorpio energy with temperance oof wow for a lot of you guys there's somebody from your past here that wants to come back in somebody from your past here is mad as all hell they are not happy 
for a lot of you guys you have somebody from your past they are mad as all hell that y'all haven't come back together as of yet this person is not happy not content not at all for some of you guys it could be a scorpio or a sagittarius this is somebody that wants to come back towards you this is definitely someone here that wants to come back towards you this person is not happy not at all show me spirit yeah four of wands this could be somebody that you were in a relationship with this could be somebody that you were living with this is this is somebody here that you were building a family dynamic with for some of you guys this could have been somebody here that you were married to that you're divorced king of pentacles virgo taurus capricorn energy could definitely be another earth sign this is somebody you stop giving to you stop giving your love to this person you stop giving see we have that king of pentacles with the ace of cups in the reverse you stop giving your love to this person look at that you they stop being your dream they stop being what you wanted but they're wanting they're wanting to come back though this person is wanting to come back to you though yeah for some of you guys this person made the mistake of moving on to someone else yeah show me spirit What's this person's intentions? What's this person's intentions? Six of Cups, they not, they, that's all they do is think, 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 think. For some of you guys, this person wants to come back to you with that Six of Cups. This person's intentions is to come back to you. Yeah, to offer you love. This person wants a new beginning with you. This person wants a new beginning with you. And this person's intentions is to return. Nine of Pentacles, Virgo Energy. This person doesn't want to be single. They don't want you to be single. But for a lot of you guys, this person themselves, they're not single. For some of you guys, this person could be having some type of financial issues. Eight of Wands, you could have this person blocked. There's blocks in communication. There's blocks in travel. Nine of Wands, yeah. I feel like this person is so freaking tired. If you got this person blocked, this person is tired of your shit. I don't know why I'm hearing this person is tired of your shit. Like this person is tired of your shit. What is this person's next actions towards my Virgos? Hmm, let's see. The hangman. Like, I don't see them doing much. I don't see them doing much, but yeah, they're coming back. You see that six of swords? They might have gone to something else, but they're still coming back. Look, yeah, to you. Yeah. This is somebody that you're separated from, the lovers. This person made a bad choice. For some of you guys, this person could have actually gone to someone else. But look at that. This person is coming back. Could be a Cancer Scorpio Pisces. There's an energy here of somebody being left out in the cold. There's an energy here of this person coming back to you. Hmm. This person feels like they made a bad choice. For some of you guys, this could have been another Virgo. Gemini. Pisces this person there's a shift in this person's perspective this person is seeing this person is seeing your value so differently now this person is seeing your value so differently now yeah how does my Virgo feel about this person the hermit so you're cautioned about this person judgment hmm you've rendered judgment a lot of you guys you're you're indecisive on the judgment that you've rendered for some of you guys, you're going back and forth on your decision itself. A lot of you guys, this talks about you listening to your intuitions, using your discernment, talks about wisdom, talks about withdrawn energy. A lot of you guys, you're kind of, you're very cautious when dealing with this person. There's, a, there's an energy here of thinking though, but there's also an energy here of no communication. There's an energy here of no communication. Like some of you guys, it's like you're trying to make the best judgment for yourself. The best judgment call. Trying to make the best decision when it comes to dealing with this person. I feel like for a lot of you guys, your intuition is telling you that this person is going to be coming back to you. But there's an energy here of what is it? Do you want it or do you not want it? Big, big energy. Yeah. What is it that this person is hiding from my Virgos? five of cups their sadness and their disappointment this person is extremely sorry this person is extremely extremely sorry this person is in some serious regret some serious regret look at that for their behavior for their choice this person is regretting their choice 
For some of you guys, this person is experiencing some type of disappointment in a marriage or another connection itself. For some of you guys, this person has some legal issues. Three of Pentacles, this person could have been involved in something third party themselves. This person could have been involved in something third party themselves. This person thought something was better somewhere else and it, dis it did not work out that way. Or this person just went off and they didn't find better. Yeah. Hmm. The chariot. Yeah, there's no forward movement here. This is this is this is a no-go. Cancer energy, three of swords. You guys are focused on your healing. You guys are focused on your healing. The Empress, this is you showing love to yourself. This is you turning your energy back towards yourself. This is you guys turning your energy back towards yourself. For some of you guys, you may truly cuss this person out. Yeah, because you're tired of their BS. And whatever offer they come with, it's not big enough. It's not, it's not what you want. Yeah. A lot of you guys, you're closing the door on this. You're over it. Absolutely over it. There's a missed opportunity. You're extremely exhausted by this. You're tired of this. You're tired of this. And you don't want, like, yeah, there's a big, big energy for you guys. A big energy of you guys, like, really and truly, like, not wanting to partake or not wanting to deal with this person again. Yeah. But this person can't stop thinking about you. Show me spirit. says the journey and it says sovereignty you've been through a lot with this person look at that for a lot of you guys this person like they have a lot of work that needs to be done and look at that they're, they're watching you they're stalking you they're trying to see if you're going to take a bite of the apple but you're standing in your power look how powerful you are you're standing in your power and you see how this person is lurking this person is lurking in your energy to see if you're going to take a bite of the apple, but you're, you're too powerful. You're too powerful. And a lot of you guys, you're standing on your sword of truth about what's real and what's not. That's a big, big energy. All right, my loves, if any of this resonates, please hit that like button, guys. Subscribe if you haven't. Until next time. Bye, guys.